Okay, salam alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. This is Ahmed Al-Gaili teaching Mega Goal 5. Now we are starting a new unit, Unit 6, and the title of this unit is called The Gender Divide. The Gender Divide. What is the meaning of gender? The meaning of gender. You know this word gender means the fact of being male or female, man and woman. This is the gender. When you see the word gender, that means you are male or female. Okay. Uh, before we start, this is uh, actually the, 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 uh, what, we'll see, what we will see now, what we will read, and what we will listen is considered as a controversial issue. The differences between men and women. And let's make a warm up and talk about some questions to uh, understand, to, to get ready to understand the reading and the listening that we will have in a while. Here, number one, in what ways do you think men and women behave differently? That means, this question means, what are the differences? How, how they behave? How can man behave? Uh, and how can a woman behave in different ways? Think about it. Think about the differences and think about answers. Okay, uh, yani if I ask you, for example, what do you think this unit will be about? This is another question. Yani since, since we have the, the title, the gender divide, what do you think? Think about the, and guess what this unit is going to be about. Yes, it's going to be about the difference between men and women. Okay, what kind of differences? What are the, 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 the differences that or the fields of differences between men and, and women. Differences in emotions, okay, and in mental abilities and in physicals. And uh, three kinds of differences, emotional differences, uh, uh, physical differences, and mental differences. So in what way do you think men and women behave differently? Uh, you can answer this by your own and you can uh, take it from uh, mental pers perspective or uh, me uh, emotional perspective or physical perspective. And uh, these differences are very clear. In number two, in what ways do you think their behavior is similar? Uh, how, they, how are they similar and what are uh, the, sim uh, the, the, the similar points and the differences uh, between them? Think about it. Number three, do you think there are more similarities or differences? You think there are more similarities or different? Which is more? Similarities, tashabuh, differences, ikhtilaf. Which is more your, in your opinion? You think similarities or differences? You can answer yourself. Okay, now, do you think, this is another question, do you think you know a lot about men and women? You know about them, about the, this gender or these two genders? Okay. Uh, Answer, sorry, answer true or false for these statements. Think, uh, then check your answers with the result uh, of gender studies. Okay, now after we answer these questions, whether true or false, okay, we will uh, 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 we'll listen and read uh, a study regarding gender. Um, uh, yani it is, it is as, as I told you, a controversial issue, and nothing is a fact. There are no facts. Okay, this is the, the study reflection and the study result, but it's, it's not a fact. You can check your own, and you can um, maybe, maybe your ideas are better than the result of this uh, study. Now, uh, let's read the question and answer it. Okay, women talk more than men. Do you think this sentence is true or false? Okay, the study says it is false. Yes. Okay, the study says it is false. Women tend to worry more than men. Worry, okay, worry means القلق uh, or emotions. Women uh, tend to, to worry more than men. That's true. Number three, men are more truthful 
than women. They say the truth. They, they don't lie. Is it true or false? It is false, unfortunately, yes. Number four, men are more easily bored than women. Get bored. Yes, men get bored uh, means feeling uh, disappointed or feeling unhappy uh, quickly. They can get bored. Okay, يطفشون. Easily. Okay, number five. Women have a greater tolerance to pain. They can bear pain more than men. It is false, not true. According to the study, it's not a fact actually. Number six, women live longer than men. Do you think that women live longer than men? Yes, it's true. It's true. The ages or the, 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 the time that women live is more. Okay then, uh, let's read, listen. And we will discuss each part later on. Do you think you know a lot about men and women? Answer true or false for these statements. Then check your answers with the results of gender studies. 1. Women talk more than men. 2. Women tend to worry more than men. 3. Men are more truthful than women. 4. Men are more easily bored than women. 5. Women have a greater tolerance for pain. 6. Women live longer than men. I think women... T okay. So this is the, uh, the, the, the result of the study. But... Uh, um, it's not a fact, as I said earlier. Listen to the reminder, uh, to the, sorry, listen to the, the, the remainder of the, the, this study. And before you listen to that, uh, let me ask you some questions. Are you surprised by any of these th uh, findings? Are you surprised, these findings? Maybe you are, maybe you are not. You are, maybe you agree with some of them, and maybe you, are not, you don't agree. Which finding surprised you? Which one of these uh, study results that uh, surprised you? Okay, you need to, to think about it. Which findings were you already sure of? Maybe one of these findings, you're sure about it and you believe in it. Okay. Did you discuss these gender differences and similarities before? You, you, did you uh, make a discussion regarding the differences between men and women? Maybe you did, yes. Do you feel differently about gender stereotype now? Do you think that something changed your stereotyping idea about uh, the differences between men and women? You might change it after you listen and read to the remainder of this uh, uh, part or this uh, reading or listening, okay? Now, uh, to understand better, I usually introduce the vocabulary uh, to make listening and reading easier for you. So let me review with you the vocabulary that you are going to hear and listen to in this uh, text or this conversation. Number one, stereotype. What's the meaning of stereotype? A set idea that people have about what someone or something is like, especially an idea that's wrong. Stereotype, that is the idea that stays in your mind for a long time, and it is, it is usually uh, uh, inherited by cultures, okay? Usually, not always. Uh, the, next, the next one is repetitive. What's repetitive? This is the, 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 origin of, uh, the origin of this word is repeat, the verb rep repeat. Repetitive is an adjective of the verb repeat, involving doing or saying the same thing several times. You will hear it in the, uh, in the audio now. Okay, the word typical, showing the characteristics of a particular kind of person or thing. The word tolerance, the word tolerance, the ability to deal with someone or something unpleasant or annoying or to continue existing despite bad or difficult conditions. Okay, okay, restless, not able to stay still or relax because you are bored 
or nervous okay this word this one okay okay this one is uh, tem temperament okay temperament the emotional character or state of mind of a per of people or animal as shown in their behavior okay temperament next one speculate speculate means expect to guess possible answers to a question when you don't have enough information to be certain this one is tedious the synonym of boring very long and not interesting it's tedious okay sorry uh, the fact of being male and female is gender as we said earlier now let's listen to the rest of the conversation and we, then we will answer the question much more than men that's just a stereotype though i do think women talk more than men about certain things like what women like to talk about their feelings but men usually don't men would rather talk about sports or cars typical one the common stereotype that women talk more than men is wrong in fact recent research shows that there is very little gender difference in how much people speak some research suggests that men tend to speak more than women in formal settings and that women speak more in informal situations one study revealed that women speak an average of about 16,000 words a day and men do too Two, studies show that women worry more frequently and more often than men. This may be due to the fact that women's brains produce less of a brain chemical called COMT, which controls anxiety. Having less of this chemical can make it harder for a person to stop worrying. Three, women lie frequently and men do too. However, research shows that women and men tend to lie about different things. Women are more likely to lie in order to try to not hurt a person's feelings. They are also more likely to lie to try to avoid a conflict. However, you are more likely to be told a lie by a man for a different reason. Men more often lie in order to make themselves seem more impressive. Four, studies show that men have more restless temperaments than women, for example, Women seem to have a capacity to adjust to repetitive tasks, but men don't. They dislike being asked to do such tasks and are less likely to successfully complete them. It is speculated that women do better in these situations because they have a greater ability to keep their thoughts and imagination active, even during tedious activities. Five, many people assume that since women have babies and men don't, women probably have a greater ability to deal with pain. However, the research seems to indicate that, due to their body chemistry, women actually have lower tolerance for pain. During recovery after surgery, women tend to experience pain with greater frequency and intensity than men do. Six, women outlive men all around the world, sometimes by an average of as much as 10 years. For example, in the U.S., the average life expectancy is about 79 for women, but only 72 for men. The gap is largest among people who live to be 100 or older. Worldwide, among people 100 or older, women outnumber men 9 to 1. Okay, so this is the, the study result, and believe it or not. Okay. Okay, sorry. And now let's go to the exercise now to answer uh, the questions now. Look at the words here. Anxiety, gender, rep uh, repetitive, uh, stereotype, uh, temperament, capacity, intensity, re restless, and tedious. Let's put them in the right space. The first one, 
the that blonde-haired people are not smart is ridiculous. What's the answer? Stereotype. The stereotype number two: we were bored and restless, so we decide to find something to do. Number three: that film is very repetitive. It repeats things very, very much. It shows the same place over and over. Number four: I always feel overwhelming anxiety and night before a, a test. Uh, overwhelming anxiety the night before a test. Number five, the intensity of the thunderstorm made the animals nervous. Okay, uh, we reviewed also the other vocabulary. Let's get the, the answer of six, seven, eight, and nine. Some, some people believe that animals have the capacity to feel the same emotions that humans do. Number seven, Louisa has the lovely temperament. She is always happy and smiling. Okay, that is uh, her uh, personality. Number eight, finding sources for an, easy, uh, an essay can be a time-consuming and tedious task. Tedious, okay. Number nine, the gender of animal often has a specific name. For example, a male horse is a stallion and a female horse is a mare. Okay, this is the uh, exercise and let's go to the last section. Last section in here. And what type of setting do women uh, tend to speak more? What they speak about? Okay, women tend to speak more in informal settings. This is the uh, tendency of women. Number two, what causes women to worry more than men, women's brain produ produces less of chemical that controls anxiety than men's. Okay, number three, what things do women tend to lie about? What they lie about? And what things do men tend to lie about? Okay, when the, when the, when the women lies and when the man lies, what they lie about? Number uh, three, women tend to lie to avoid hurting others' feelings. And men tend to lie, uh, to lie to make themselves look more impressive. You see, you know, um, um, if you have a comment on this, that means women are better than more human than uh, and than men. They they uh, they act uh, wisely and they they care about others more than th themselves. So this is a very good thing to happen, actually. Number four. What might explain women's ability to deal with uh, repetitive tasks better than men? It's possible that men, women, are better keeping their thoughts and imaginations. Okay, this is the difference here. Number five, which gender has the longer life expansion? Give an example. Okay, women have longer life expansion than men. In the USA, life expansion for women is 79 years. They live for 79 years and women live for 72 years. So the expansion of men are less than the expansion of women. So that's all regarding our class today and I hope you enjoyed it and if, if you uh, want to improve your, your reading, your vocabulary, you will need to, uh, you need to read and listen to the audio uh, we uh, will support you to, to you in uh, the interactive program. Thank you very much and goodbye.